Kissing in the rain, walking on the beach I can see it now, almost happening Sneaking out at night, living like we're free You and I could do anything we please You I wanted to start off by showing you what I'm working with here. This is my hair blow dry, but it is naturally straight with a little bit of frizz in some parts. And here's my tool of the trade for today. This is the Birds of Paradise Limited Edition GHD. It is so pretty, right? Before I use any heat on my hair, I am going to use a heat protectant. I like to spray it all around and then brush it through and air it out a little, otherwise it tends to steam while the straightener goes on it. I like to divide my hair into sections and then straighten it using a comb so that I don't burn my fingers. The comb actually helps the straightener run through the hair a lot easier too I find. My hair is naturally straight but using the straightener on it just leaves it nice and silky smooth. For the props. Today I'm using this headband from La Visa, which I think adds a finishing accessory touch to any formal outfit. Don't worry, I do show the hairstyles with and without it. To clip in my extensions, I start off by sectioning my hair and then teasing it at the roots. Then I'll clip in the extensions and repeat until they are all in. Here I'm just going over with some more heat protectant and then I'm brushing it through once again. And here I'm just running over the ends with the hair straightener just to make sure it's all straight. So I'm back at the heat protectant again and I'll brush it through and then I will section off my hair and start curling it from the front to the back. I'm making sure all the curls are facing away from my face and it's all really in the flick of a wrist. You'll get used to it, you just need to practice. And I do have a more in-depth tutorial on how I curl my hair with the GHD which I'll link down below if you're interested. I'll be a baby picture birth, barefoot beauty. You stole my heart just like in a movie. Got the key and tell me, tell me, tell me I'm your darling Daisy. Picture birth, sweet like candy. I'll be your girl. Once all of the hair is curled, I'll use some hairspray on it and then go through it with a wide tooth comb. Then with a smaller tooth comb, I start to section off layers from the top of the head and tease them at the roots. I'll apply some hairspray and then hold the can in place underneath the hair for a few seconds, which will give me so much extra volume. Once I've done the top half of my head, I will comb it all out and make it smooth. To give your hair some extra body, you can tease the ends with your fingers by holding a section and pulling your fingers through the hair like I'm doing here. Oh, 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 let's pretend that I feel like giving it if nothing else, I'll imagine babe. You'll need some bobby pins for this one. After combing my hair with a wide tooth comb, I section off a part of my hair at the crown of my head and comb it back. I'll use the teasing method with the hairspray to achieve the volume I need and then secure the section with some bobby pins. So breathe in from your head to your toes, feel it like you know. Oh, 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 oh. let's pretend. Mm, yeah, 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 that I've got the good safe from with the cardiac. Just 
I then tease the part underneath so that it is easy to work with and twist it around and secure it with some more bobby pins. Keep in mind it does not need to be neat. Then what I do is take sections of hair from the side and then twist them and then secure them in the hair already pinned down at the back. Keep repeating this until you're left with some small sections at the front that you're happy with or you can really pin it all back if that's what you want. <laughs> I'll keep checking back in the mirror and pinning down any bits of hair that are not pinned and readjusting the hair until all the bobby pins are covered and I'm happy with how it looks. Let's break away from what we know. Just say the word, just say go. No better time than now to make our move. Let's find a place to leave our shoes among the stars. They have no use when I'm with you. When I'm with you, I feel so weightless. Let's fly. Now I'm just going to clip in my curly hair extensions, so that's what I'm doing here. Let's break away from where we've been. Let's raise a sail and chase the wind. Before I put the hair down all over the hair extensions, I am going to tease it at the roots, uh, just to give it a bit of volume. And then I'm back at that heat protection once again, so spritzing it through and then combing and brushing it through my hair, and then I will get on to curling it. I'm not going to be massively neat, I'm just taking a chunk and then curling it and flipping it over my shoulder. You guys can take more time and smaller chunks of hair if you like, but I'm just going to be a little bit free with this. <laughs> Once it's all curled, I then will comb it through with the wide tooth comb again and put some hairspray on it all to set it in place. This hairstyle is so, so simple. I'm just taking the front parts of my hair and then kind of placing them underneath the back part of my hair and using two bobby pins, I'm going to cross them over and pin it back. And I'm just doing that to both sides and making sure the hair covers the bobby pins. You're the kind of reckless that you'd send me running by. Kind of know that I won't get far. You stood there in front of me. And then I'm just curling a few extra pieces at the front just because I felt they needed it. And you're done.
After taking the bobby pins out, I am going to sweep my hair to one side and secure it with a hair tie. I just want to fluff out the top a little bit and then what I'm going to do is take a bit of hair and wrap it around the hair tie so that it is not visible. My mind forgets to remind me You're a bad idea You touch me once and it's really something I'll then secure some shorter bits that didn't quite make it into the ponytail and make sure everything's all hidden and covered and poofed up and pretty. So there are all of my hairstyles. I hope you enjoyed the video and now have some inspiration for your formal occasion. Leave me a comment with your favorite hairstyle of mine today and also check down below for the makeup tutorial if you wanted to go and check that out as well. Have a fantastic day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!